Look at this tremendous array of flowers, spectacular, deep, blood red, very, very vivid. Now notice what they've done here. They've taken Dusty Miller, which actually has no flowers, but it, it's a grayish white leaf plant and they've tightly clustered a border along this entire bed and absolutely packed the fuchsia red geranium in the center. Now notice there's hardly any weeds here. They used a pre-emergent herbicide when they installed these plants. Preen is one and uh, miracle Grow, the Scotts company, has a weed preventer and a weed preventer fertilizer combination. You can put that down that will retard weed development in the soil profile for a good solid four to six months. You're going to see hardly any weeds. Now, when these flowers are spent, just like the marigolds, the stem can be pinched off. It's a tubular stem. Now, here's an example of a flower blossom that is spent. It's done. It's come out for several days, maybe a week, and now it's kind of unsightly. Now you can take your clippers, go back below the green foliage, snip it off, or check this out. You take it between your forefinger and thumb and snap this tubular growth right off. So by taking these spent blossoms off, you redirect the nutrients and the growth to the new buds. Now, this is a super hardy plant, but it does have leaf spot issues, which is a fungus. Here's a leaf right here. You will have a yellow lesion that will get brown and burnt in the center. That is a leaf spot fungus, nothing to panic about. Ortho makes a product called Funginex or Orthonex, which has an insect control and a fungus control. Get you a little one or two gallon spray container. Mix, I believe the label says one ounce per gallon. Put a little teaspoon of dishwashing liquid in there. It'll make a sticking agent, if you will, the surfactant, the pesticide and fungicide will spread evenly. Spray the top and the bottom of the leaves to get full control of this disease. Do not spray during heavy periods of extreme heat and dry conditions. Never spray or fertilize when your plants are very dry or in drought stress. They should be well watered before you get chemicals applied to them. 